dear students welcome to this video series in digital electronics in this video lecture we will see about binary to seven segment display design a seven segment display can be drawn as this one is the one segment this is another segment so here we have seven segment this seven segment display is important because it can represent the decimal numbers from 0 to 9. It is called 7 segment display because it uses 7 segments A, B, C, D, E, F and last one this one is Z. Let us first see how we can represent any decimal number using this 7 segment display. So starting with 0, 0 we can represent it as that means here will have this segment of display equal to 1 and this will be 0 that means a b c d e f and z is 0 that means here we'll have a equal to 1 b equal to 1 c equal to 1 d equal to 1 e equal to 1 f equal to 1 and c equal to 0 so similarly for 1 we have to use only these two segment equal to 1 that means b c that means here we'll have a equal to 0 b equal to 1 c equal to 1 d equal to 0 e equal to 0 f equal to 0 and z equal to 0 now we'll make the truth table of this decimal to 7 segment display truth table of a decimal to 7 segment display so to represent the decimal numbers from 0 to 9 we require 4 bit representation that means here we'll write the decimal number here we'll write binary input that means the binary representation of the decimal number that means binary input here and seven segment segment output for binary representation of any decimal number from 0 to 9 we will need 4 bit representation so we'll represent this 4 bit as d3 d2 d1 and d0 and the seven segment output we have means a b c d e f z a b c d e f and z so for the decimal number 0 the binary representation is 0 0 0 0 that means for zero number we had a equal to 1 b equal to 1 c equal to 1 d equal to 1 e equal to 1 f equal to 1 and z equal to 0 so here we will put these values and z is 0 and similarly for 1 we will have the binary representation as 0 0 0 1 and for 1 we will have a equal to 0 b equal to 1 c equal to 1 d equal to 0 e equal to 0 f equal to 0 z equal to 0 and so on so now we'll make the complete truth table we require only these up to 9 these decimal numbers are required all these are that means don't care condition
in this truth table here 0 denotes this this segment is off and 1 denotes this segment is on so from here we can make the Carnot map and from there we can find out the expression for a b c d e f z now we will make the Carnot map for each of these outputs and we'll find out the expression for this first of all let us make the kmf for a so for a we have one zero one one zero one zero one one zero zero one 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 we have the on the front. Now we can take it as. Let us make another combination like this, and for this one we can combine it as. And because it's a gray code. Therefore, the expression of A can be written as A equal to D1 plus D2 D0 plus D3 plus D2 bar D0 bar. So, this is the expression for, for the first segment. The KMF for B. KMF for B. Function for B is from this term we will have D1 bar D0 bar for this one we have D1 D0 for this one we will have D2 bar so now we will make the camera for C Have one one zero one 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 for D. For D we have D equal to one zero one one zero one zero one one zero one one zero one 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 zero one one so these are the don't care conditions For E, we get Boolean function of D1 D0 bar plus D2 bar D0 bar, and F we got D2 plus D3 plus D1 bar D0 bar. Similarly, we got the Boolean function for the segment Z, and these are the output expression or output Boolean functions for the output segments. So these are the output segment expressions in terms of the input. These are the output segment expressions and using simple gates we can get the digital circuit for binary 27 segment display. Thank you for watching.
if you have any doubt please put in the comment section below like share and subscribe to my channel thank you